Hey guys, Mr. Browning here to do the first lecture of the velocity measurement section here. Um, <clears throat> mostly what I'm going to be going over in this is I'm going to be addressing the how to use and create graphical representations of velocity. This is in addition to the time distance graph that you're going to know, have to know how to do. Uh, mostly this video is actually going to show you guys what a strobe photo is and how it works. This is going to be important later on because you will be looking at a lot more strobe photos in the next two units, especially to understand acceleration. So we're going to go ahead and get started right here. Um, I'm going to use the physics talk as a medium to explain this. Um, so here they're showing you two strobe photos. The strobe photo does is it takes a picture in different increments of time. So both of these photos, let's just say they took one picture every second. Okay, so here, this is one car. Okay, this one car travels. You can see in the first second it was here. In the second second it was here and in the third second it was here. So what you can do is you can figure, okay, well, what is the distance between this car and here and here and here? All right, the longer this distance is, the faster that car is actually going. Because if it covers a larger distance in the same amount of time, it has to go faster. So you can imagine the car down here, because it has a greater distance between each of the pictures, it's going much faster. And you could actually use these strobe photos then to calculate for velocity. And then calculating velocity will be in the next lecture. Um, but understanding Again, understanding these strobe photos is going to help you in the next couple sections. And there's also going to be some tools that we're going to use that are very, very similar to the idea of strobe photos. Um, I think that about covers it. I mean, the further these are apart, the longer the distance that it covered in the same amount of time, the closer they are, the slower they're going, because they cover a shorter amount of distance in the same amount of time. Make sure you write down any questions that you have. Other than that, see you guys next time.